the yellow man, another 2,000 years. Then after that brown man, uh, that brown man and that yellow man he brought out, then he got to the last stage of what blonde head and blue eyes, pale skin. Took 600 years. 600 years. To bring the white to man bring out. bring the white man out of the black out man. Out of the black man. Out of the black man. That so that's, a 20, that's part of that 25,000 year cycle. So now we are entering into the 7,000 year of that 25,000 uh, 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 year in the, into the righteousness of God. And that's why I say righteousness is our stand for the righteous man. So we are righteous by nature with God. So if, if you want power, the power is, is in our righteousness and our morality and in the moral fabric of our being, because that's God. God have morality, he have uh, righteousness, and he have uh, a, a moral stand. And the moral stand is uh, having uh, no one to go and do things that the made man done for the last 6,000 years. So this 25,000 year cycle, the Honorable Elijah Muhammad says, we will go into now, uh, into a new world. And uh, that world is called the hereafter. And the hereafter mean that people, live people, will we'll leave here and, 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 and go into a place where there is no more sickness, no more doctors, no more headaches, no more lumbago. No, no, we're going to a place where you don't need doctors, only nurses or midwives. He said to us that <clears throat> this man, this world in which we live, and they didn't see a lot of the, the people coming out. See, we didn't see a lot of people coming out of uh, uh, to going to heaven. Uh, around 144,000. That's all they saw coming out of hell. Because the, the rest of them, was, that's why the Bible say, for, 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 for corruption had become so bad. Filth had got so bad. So God shortened the days. At least no flesh would be saved. That's how wicked Satan had gotten. Satan had gotten so wicked that he was trying to battle God. So God had to cut short the days in order to destroy Satan. And those of us, they called that 144,000, you'd be like virgins. Without uh, foul by man, only meant, the messenger says, we would not be mixing up truth with falsehood while we know it. Uh, I got to go back because people think that's craziness. The messenger's teaching said, oh, I got five minutes left. Man, it's going so fast. Oh, wow. Yeah, that means it's going, and when it goes fast, it was a good show. Uh, the messenger talked, of course, uh, the, it was a 6,600 year process bringing out the white man yeah. out of the black man. Yeah. And people say that's crazy. But the scientists, the modern day scientists already tell you that blonde, people who are blonde here, blonde people would not be on the planet Earth for another 200 years. That's right. They're dying off. Yes. White people, if I remember correctly, the messenger said that after a thousand years, there'll be no more white people after a thousand right. years. Okay, I'm right about that, right? I remember that right. part. And now, people think that's so far fetched, but white people, as we know, are a declining population. In Europe, they're, they're going down, they're dying mm -hmm. off. Here in America, they're flatlined. They're going to be starting to die off soon in America. The point is, how can America, and I, go, and I know they answer the question, how can America maintain its number one world superpower status as it declines in white population, as it declines as an empire? How? America cannot uh, rule as a superpower. America is not a superpower today. America is telling her people that she's a superpower. But when you go travel outside of America, you see America not a superpower. America pleading to the people of the world, don't destroy me, help me, bring me peace. But the righteous say, God say, I come to make war. I'm going to be the end of all wars. I come to all the fighting that you wanted to do. This is going to be the end of it. And never again would the righteous be bothered by your kind of, of, of civilization. As, 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 as Al Gore said the other day, we must do something quick about the global warming because civilization as we know it soon will be no more. I said, listen to this devil. He's talking to the wise. He's talking to the smart people. Not so much of a global warming, but we got to do something with this black man. This black man, we don't lie to the people about him. We got to do something because if we don't. God going to take this whole thing and give it to his chosen people. And that's the Negro, the so-called American Negro, the Asiatic black man. They see it coming. But see, I, see that again. See, that's a hard concept for even black folks, so-called African-Americans, to accept. 
that we are chosen people. We're in a divine era of a divine time. And not that you're going to go in the sky to meet no, Jesus. He no. coming down to see you. It's, I, I believe, if you will, this, this is not the message teaching. This is Mark Sims teaching that we're here to really, we have the opportunity, if we wanted to, to usher in a new era of peace, justice, and equality on the planet Earth. Now, I ain't the message. That's my era. Yeah. That's my well, teaching, if you will. Well, that's that going to be peace and harmony yeah. and happiness on Earth in the hereafter. That's on Earth. That's after the white man's after rule. After the white man's rule. After we separate from the white man and America's being burned up for 390 years. But something that means a lot of us going to be burned up a here lot, in America. Oh, yes. There's no doubt about it. They don't, don't we all ain't getting out. Well, 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 well <laughs> those whom God befriend, those who love God and his messenger and the message that he brings will be saved. No matter if you're white, black, Hispanic, those whatever, who, Asian. Those who love the messenger. But in the hereafter, all those, I mean, all the people who do good for the, 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 the blind man, the do good by those of us who are in bondage. Mm -hmm. God will let them go out. They can go back to their country and go back to Asia, go back to China, go back to Europe. Because Europe won't uh, be destroyed at the same time America. Mm. Uh, Europe will last a few more years. But this is going. But America is going. This going, is going. going up in fire. So when you got your passport? And, and that's well, we don't, you don't need a passport to get out. Okay. You, you're going to be able to leave. You don't need a passport. Okay. It, just like the Bible says in Revelation, at last that mighty city, that giant city, the country will say at last it's destroyed. It's utterly destroyed. They'll see us smoke from afar off. That's in the book of Revelation. All right. They want to come see you. Sunday, what time? Now Sunday you come uh, at 10 o'clock. Yeah. Doors open. 1030. The meeting start every Sunday at 10 o'clock. See you at Muhammad's Temple of Islam. Bring your questions. You're on Michigan now, right? On Michigan Avenue. What's that, 50? Uh, 5537 South Michigan Avenue. What's the phone number? Uh, 773 Six six seven five nine two seven. Well, that's mine. They can call, but they, they, they be not afraid. Be, well, be not afraid. Just come and hear the truth. Ask questions and find out all about yourself. I am your brother, brother minister.